Welcome back to Honkai Star Rails, beautiful bright stars. I want to do this puzzle real quick. Oh gosh, we're picking up where we last left off. Uh, okay. I'm gonna do this real quick. Hopefully, hopefully it's quick. Oh, oh, I, I now see the blue thing on the left. Oh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> I didn't see that. The freight starts, star skiff? Slowly moves into the jetty. I don't know what a star skiff is or a jetty. <laughs> <laughs> These are my tips. That wasn't too difficult. <laughs> Worth our while. <laughs> Indeed. Would it really? Oh, they just show me everything. Okay. Oh, here we go, though. Oh. <laughs> I despise that they disappeared. Shards of a Cloud Knight's weapon. Something really sharp caused this. What? It must have been Kafka. She's got a scary sword. Does she? I don't remember. Oh. Good quality, good price. Immortal's delight. Immortal's delight. This isn't a clue. It's just a brand of tea I like. Oh, okay. Two cups a day keeps the tiredness at bay. I could do with a cup once we're done here. <laughs> Milk tea twins. She sounds so fake. I'm sorry. Like her voice actress does a great job, but she's like Milk tea twins. Like it's so forced and it's bleh. Anyway, sorry. <laughs> I grew up with people like that, okay? <laughs> They're so annoying. Yo, that's so sick. I love that so much. <laughs> uh, past victories don't guarantee future ones. Look, Ding found a strange chest. Oh. And there's a handprint on it. Let me oh. see. <laughs> Slender fingers, but strong. This hand belongs to a killer. Beautiful. Uh, there's a note here, too. Take your fancy, there's a reward inside. Oh. Oh, why do I get the feeling we're not the ones doing the hunting? <laughs> it seems like Kafka predicted our every move. Stay alert, all of you. Of course. We could be walking into a trap. True, true. <gasps> Come on, little doggy. What's this? It looks like clay. Mr. Yang, any idea? I think it might be shipbuilding material left over from the assembly line, though hmm. I can't tell exactly what the substance is. I don't think it's connected to Kafka. No? Okay. If you say so. Ha <laughs> ha just in case. Check is every nook and cranny. Anything to do with Kafka? That's a shipwright's soldering gun. I think one of the workers here must have left it behind. Why would they do that? <laughs> Don't bark when they're... <laughs> Don't turn the camera when there's an enemy right there. <laughs> How dare, I almost missed them. <laughs> Knowledge, the measure of truth, and falsehood. Nice. Okay, yes, what? A D-Tang smells something. Yeah, an enemy? What's this? A jade seal used by the shipwrights. It opens various passages. It looks like someone used it and then destroyed it. Possibly oh. Kafka. Oh. Oh, sneaky. Okay, okay. <laughs> Sneak attack. <laughs> Too late to repent. Lance forward. <laughs> so dope. I love that one so much. It's such a good one. Right. 
Ooh. I didn't know you were there. Yes? I know, I know. Let's go and have a look. Uh, is that a grenade? What's that on the side? Oh. Uh, it's lipstick. Oh gosh. A small something for the lost. Uh, she's clearly taunting us. We should have enough clues here to get Deeding on the move. Oh yeah. No time to lose. Yeah. Let's give him the scent and let him lead the way. Okay. But, uh... Oh. <laughs> A test. We should have enough clues here to get Deeding on the move. Yeah, I know. No time to lose. Let's give him the scent and let him lead the way. Ooh, Ooh should I? This will strengthen our position. Can't be. <laughs> I shall. We'll we'll try it. Although I probably should have healed, but uh, no, it's okay. The measure I of truth and falsehood. <laughs> we uh, should have enough clues here to get Deeding on the move. Whoa! No I get set far lose. back. I didn't know that. Let's give him the scent and let him lead the way. Don't think it's over, okay? I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna stab you in the back. <laughs> I think we've rounded up all our suspicious clues. But did Kafka leave them behind on accident or on purpose? I would say on purpose. Uh, she sure did put a lot of work into this gag, and I think we're the punchline. Uh, making us run around like jerks? I bet she's <laughs> loving this. I can almost hear her whispering. Come and get me. <laughs> that was scary. That would be suitably Kaf Kafkesk? Kafka esque? That's okay, there we go. She sure is a Stellaron hunter. Well, why don't you go and marry her, huh? Marsh? What the Oh okay, okay. Chill. I don't, okay? Don't forget, she's Sheesh. on the IPC's most Jealous wanted much? list. A fugitive <laughs> that nobody can seem to pin down. And now we've become her prey while she stalks us in the shadows. Let's go, benefactors. Time is of the essence. We must be close. Oh. Uh, bye. <laughs> bye, doggy. <laughs> Oh, there he is. Oh, look, you didn't come down with me. <laughs> Whoa. Puzzle. Oh, this is that one. That's right. Uh, okay. That was sheer accident. <laughs> but I got it. <laughs> Very nice. <laughs> oh. That's, that's dumb. <laughs> it wouldn't open even though I'm on the other side. Another chest, another handprint. Oh. Has this woman got nothing better to do? <laughs> A little cheese for the rats in the maze? Oh, that's messed up. Rats? Oh, she's playing games with us. I hate her. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty good. <gasps> Let's go, cute little guy. Follow the evil mist. <gasps> Space anchor, thank you. Where did it go? Did it disappear? Oh, when the trace of the hunted disappears, the hunter better think twice. Uh... Hi, Kafka. It might mean the tables have turned. Wait. Kafka! Why... 
These cloud knights yeah. aren't Mara struck. What did you do to them? Why are they working with her? Just a little persuasion to get them to listen to me. But you know all about that already, don't you? <laughs> huh? Do I? <laughs> oh, what a hassle. This place is too far for the Diviner. See you up ahead. Huh? What? 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 Am I supposed to get what's going on? <laughs> How dare. <laughs> Uh, quick! Don't let her escape! It's okay. What? I'm not so fast. Oh, true. March is a little eager, isn't she? Hang on. <laughs> I need all the secrets, okay? And I need to unlock everything just in case. Wait, what is over here? Just leads back. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. I'm a worry wart. I just want to heal everybody, okay? Okay, now we could go. <laughs> oh, hello. <gasps> hello. <laughs> Okay, now we can get him. <laughs> Kafka! <laughs> so close and yet so far. You'll have to pick up the pace. I would! You just leave so many monsters in your wake. You know? Like, chill with that. <laughs> okay, bye! It's not like we can't squeeze through the side there. <laughs> Uh, there's no way through here. Oh, of course we not. We need to think of a way to cut her off. <laughs> Don't worry about locked doors, benefactors. We can use the conveyor belts. Oh, yeah, true. I mean, you know, not like a normal human being can easily step over that and fit through these. Is there glass in them? <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> uh... I always make fun of designs, okay? <laughs> mm-hmm. That's mine now. I accept. Beautiful. As would any man. All right, now we can go. This will strengthen our position. Yeah. Alright, let's go, doggy. We have Kafka to chase. Oh, wrong way. Dang it. <laughs> oh, okay, good. <laughs> I was like... <laughs> We need a strategy. Oh, you strong man. Hello. Okay, I'll come back for you. I love these hard puzzles, they're so great. <laughs> oh, there she is. Hang on, anything good around here? 
Aw. <laughs> Welcome, okay. Astral Expressors. Thank you. Looks like you caught me. Oh my gosh, it looks like we walked right into your trap. You sure ran away really fast. You're finished. Surrender. You have the right to remain silent. What am I, an officer now? <laughs> this was all part of your plan. I think so. <laughs> Don't laugh at me. <laughs> Admit it, Kafka. You planned for us to come here. Well, I didn't plan anything. No? It was the future. Oh. We interfere on Fate. countless future possibilities and make the best future a reality. Oh. You speak too highly of us, Welt. The Stellaron Hunters are merely Destiny's slaves. If that's the case, then aren't we all Destiny slaves? <laughs> best future? Best for who? As if you'd consider anyone but yourself. She's got a point. <laughs> if I said best for the universe, would you believe me? No. <laughs> best for me, naturally. <laughs> Surrender and save your explanations for the... Shinjo. Is that how you say it? <laughs> I don't remember. If you want to fight, quit stalling. I have a lot to ask you. I do. If you want to. We're answer. taking you to see the general of the law fool. You can profess your innocence all you like, but the general will decide your fate. Okay. Oh, thanks. But no thanks. No? I can't stand moving at someone else's pace. Are we gonna fight Kafka? Oh, we don't have much time. If I were you, I'd make a move before it's too late. What does she mean by that? Oh, we're fighting Kafka! <laughs> We're so dead. <laughs> We're so Not dead. So How does that feel? Ay ya! <laughs> Sheesh! Okay, okay. <laughs> the truth of life and death. The sanctuary is but a vision. I'm asking questions. Answer me. Zero points. <laughs> Oof. Fighting is meaningless. Oh, I can't. Why did she have to do it to Japan? He's my shield. <laughs> Something for everybody, ready? Oh, oh, cool. Lance okay, a blaze. Lance forward. Did I say <laughs> What did I just say? <laughs> Kafka makes me say weird things. S A S P. Knowledge, the measure of truth and falsehood. It's time. Wow, Japard could be so mean. Zero points. This really sucks. Don't die, Japard. Uh, your answers. Kill Kafka. I'm on guard. Kill her. <laughs> Oh, this hey. ends here in the name of Landau. A will forged in ice. <laughs> because Never he can. Very nice, very nice. <laughs> Nicely done. Oh. <gasps> Finally. Oh. Oh. Rudimentary. Your every move has been foreseen. Whoa, by Domnissia. Okay, Miss Graceful. Divination Commission. I'll be taking the criminal from here. Greetings, that crew was pretty. of the Astral Express. Dang. This is our first encounter. Though given that I have encountered you in Foresight, perhaps I should say the second. Oh. Uh, okay. I am Fu Xuan. Master Diviner at the Divination Commission and one of the six charioteers. I mean, is she wrong? This technically is the second time we've seen her. Far-flung friends ought to be received <laughs> with fine wine. But alas, the heavens, earth, and body are not aligned for such an occasion. You'll allow for a postponement of the usual formalities, I trust? We should begin with the matter at hand. Okay. What the actual heck is she saying? Yeah, it took me a second. <laughs> She's just showing off with some big fancy words. Even my sin. What? Synesthesia beacon can't make sense of what she just said. <laughs> what she said. 
<laughs> if the method of my speech is offensive to you, you need but say. We received an assignment from General Jing Yuan to Jing arrest Yuen. the Stellaron Hunter. Thank you, <laughs> Diviner, for coming to our aid, but we must escort the fugitive to the General. An essential. I hold a proclamation from the General here, if you care to see. Ooh. Upon detaining the Stellaron Hunter, Questioning and all further arrangements are to be undertaken by the Divination Commission. Okay. <laughs> Did the General just spare us a walk with Kafka? I knew he was a good guy. <laughs> of course, March would appreciate that. Understood. However, the General promised that all intel would be shared with us. True. We have a right to know anything that Kafka divulges. Mm-hmm. Oh? Mm-hmm. That guy. Can I go one day without him throwing me under the... <laughs> we won't make things any more complicated than they need to be. We just want to listen in on the questioning. Yes, please. Very well. Urgency demands fluidity. The three of you shall accompany me to the Divination Commission. Uh, can't we do the questioning here? The Stellaron no. Hunters are slippery. What if she makes a break for it? I've... I feel like sh it would be easier for her to make a break for it here. No? Here would be better. We shouldn't delay. Are you guys up to this? What is that supposed to mean? While I am here, she will not escape. Okay. Only the Divination Commission has the methods to make her talk and bring the truth to light. Okay. The time has arrived. We must depart. Please proceed. <laughs> Let's go. Quickly now. Let's disembark here, benefactors. Bless up. <laughs> uh, I may live in relative seclusion, but I can recognize my own territory. Wh what? Why did you bring us here? Does this look like the Divination Commission to you? Oh, she took us to the wrong place. No need to yell, Master Diviner. Ooh. The Meridian Pin is malfunctioning, and I couldn't find the entrance to the Delve. I wanted to get us straight to our destination, but this is the only place I could dock the Star Skiff. Hmm. Look, Exalting Sanctum, this is a safe place. Let's just walk the rest of the way from here. You seem a little fishy. She hasn't had a problem before, so it's a little suspicious that she has a problem now when we have Kafka. <laughs> hmm. Our hexagrammatic position is fluctuating between the marsh and water trigrams. The vessel is stranded and the way is blocked. I heard the Sienjo can tell your fortune. Is that how they do it? Oh. Anyone can count on their fingers. <laughs> March, please. <laughs> The connoisseur appreciates the artistry, and the layman enjoys the show. <laughs> this must be the quantum entanglement you hear about in stories. You count on your fingers? <laughs> oh, what's wrong with that? We've got ten fingers. May as well use them. That's not what you should use your hands and your fingers for, you know? Like, there's plenty of other things than to count. You should know how to count from one to ten, March. Come on. Come on. <laughs> I just don't... performed some quick divination, and the hexagram is consistent with March our current so predicament. <laughs> the Star Skiff cannot take us to the Divination Commission today. No. Alas, without me in charge to handle the Stellaron Crisis, I dare not even imagine the kind of mess the Commission must be in. Okay, I guess I'll take your word for it. Still don't like her, it's though. It's true. The Divination Commission really can't go a single day without Lady Fu. And I hate her brown nosing, okay? Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> uh, that's why you have to develop your talent pool. Otherwise, everything falls apart when you go on vacation. Wise words from March. Look at her. <laughs> Since you are clearly ignorant of the Commission's internal affairs, I apologize, we I shall are. absolve you of your ridiculous remarks. Thank you. Bless you. You're so graceful. I'm Gracious. going ahead to make some inquiries. <laughs> Goodbye. Bye bye. Wait, we can help. What about Kafka? Sure, yeah. We shall meet again. What about Kafka? 
The prisoner must follow me every step of the way. This is Jing Yuan's order. Uh-huh. Um, you might not want to hear this, but your general gave us his word. We have to be present when you question Kafka. <sighs> you think too little of me. My word is my bond. Okay. I will stick to my promise even if this delve collapses. That's very unlikely, by the way. Okay. All right. I mean, I don't like to assume, so I'll, I'll take you at your word. Thank you. To have this prisoner speak, the commission must resort to unconventional means. The nature of which is confidential and cannot be disclosed. Oh? Forgive me. But I can assure you that the questioning will not begin until you arrive. Even if that means wasting precious time. Oh, why thank you. I have appointed someone to wait for you in front of Exalting Sanctum Plaza. What? Once we've consolidated Where? our internal affairs, you will be brought into the Divination Commission. Please be patient. All right, thank you. Uh, okay. We trust you. <laughs> mm-hmm. Uh, I think I offended someone again. <laughs> She's just annoyed that you won't trust her. Well, someone had to put her in her place, you think, March? <laughs> uh, 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 I don't want to diss on her right now or uh, poke at her some more. Hey, are you on her side? Fudge, sorry, just anything I said. I not to break her promise, that's all. No, I know, I... <sighs> I know, that's why I didn't want to poke at you, because I know you feel bad already. <laughs> so I didn't want to poke it anymore. <laughs> Don't take it to heart, March. <sighs> Miss Fushen seems like a reasonable lady. Mm. I'm sure she's not angry with you. No, I don't think she is. Just annoyed. At all of us, maybe. Really? I thought she was pretty icy. That might just be her demeanor. Some people are not what they seem. True. I'm sure she's just putting on a tough, a tough front. As icy as Dong Hung? Maybe. Uh, I don't know how to deal with people like that. Okay, That's enough okay. chit chat. I reckon the Divination Commission could be a while. Let's take a look around. Yeah! Alright. Ah, oh, that star skiff was pretty cool. There must be loads of interesting things in Exalting Sanctum. You got something to say? Hey, fancy seeing you here. Mmm, fancy. <laughs> oh gosh, dang it. What does the Divination Commission do? <sighs> you never asked what the Skyfaring Commission does. I suppose not all commissions are created equal. Sorry, okay? I don't... <laughs> I, just, I just don't want to talk to you. <laughs> anyway... If you must know, <laughs> the Divination Commission is responsible for gathering intelligence, devising strategies, and performing divination. Okay. Divination, trial by fortune telling. Divination, isn't that the same as flipping a coin? Mm, maybe there's more to it? Hmm. It's not like I would know. I'm a mere amicassiter. Okay. Don't worry. Diviner Fu seems confident about getting Kafka to talk. Mm -hmm. If I were you... I'd just sit back and watch her do her thing. All right. Will the diviner go back on her word? Diviner Fu. How do you say her? How do you say her full name? Who knows? She tends to make decisions based on the results of her divinations as opposed to what others might be thinking. I don't think she'll go back on her word. If she doesn't want to reveal the commission's secrets, then you have no choice but to wait. Mhm. Mm how come Kafka gets to know their secrets, but it's okay for a wanted fugitive to find out? Yeah, true, that is a little... The general oh. entrusted the master diviner with the interrogation of the fugitive because he has faith in her ability to manage the situation. As one of the six charioteers, she oh. is certainly capable. Oh, who are the rest of the six... Charioteer, charioteers. Why do you think Kafka surrendered at the mere sight of her back in Stargazer Navalia? Fair point. Miss Tingyun, are you familiar with this place? Oh, did you want a tour of Exalting Sanctum? <laughs> oh, the 
last time I came here on a star skiff was, well, let me think, about 20 years ago now. I've been on the road for so long that I've started to forget the sights and sounds of the Sienjo. Okay. All I remember is that this is a good place to while away the days. Still, many delves have changed beyond recognition since the arrival of the Stellaron. Okay. If you're bored, you could go and find the messenger from the Divination Commission. Okay, thank you. My dad is an ace pilot! He finished the Grey Sky Route in 12 parsecs! Nothing down there? Welts, what do you have to say? When we confronted Kafka, she seemed certain that Fu Shen would show up. Yeah, she read the script in advance. <laughs> it's like someone told her it would happen. Like a fated encounter. Hmm, I want to say that. <laughs> Break the fourth wall. <laughs> the leader of the Stellaron Hunters is called Elio. Right. No one knows who he is or what he looks like. Only that the Interastral Peace Corporation calls him Destiny's Slave. Interesting. It's said that he has the power to foresee possibilities. Oh. According to Herta, the corporation believes Elio can see the temporal branching of infinite possibilities, huh. which is very much like being able to predict the future. Yeah. In fact, huh. it may even be superior. If the rumors are true, every seemingly meaningless action taken by the Stellaron Hunters may actually be a choice based on those possibilities. Fascinating. Which would include what they did to you. Yeah, yeah. I'm different. I have free will. Well, for now, I guess. I don't know. Is that all I am? A future variable? Oh, Whatever. I only care about the present. Huh. That kind of sucks. For the sake of this discussion, Yes, I think so. Huh. But who is it? Yeah, good question. All of us are future variables, our choices solidifying reality. The future is nothing incredible either. Just a fog waiting for us to make a decision. True. Back to the matter at hand. Kafka. Her surrender seemed odd. Yeah, she didn't resist at all. It was all within her expectations. It totally was. That's why I'm like, we're chasing after her, fiddly bee. <laughs> like, it literally, I mean, she was toying with us the whole time. <laughs> yes, it's strange for a fugitive to give themselves up. Yeah. But a fugitive who can see the future? For her, perhaps that was the way it was always going to be. True. And I mean, and if it's true that Blade also escapes, like, I'm sure he could just, like, bust her out, right? <laughs> But is she really is as calm as she seems? Hang on. The future holds almost infinite possibilities, after all. Mm -hmm. I suspect she has proof that she has nothing to do with the Stellaron crisis. Maybe. But I was like, is that how Blade escaped? Is because, you know, he knew he was going to get caught, so he knew how to get out kind of a thing? Uh... Or perhaps something is supposed to transpire during the Divination Commission's interrogation. Oh. Something that would allow her a window of escape. Oh, yeah. <sighs> Ooh. Why did the Stellaron Hunters go to such lengths to bring us here? Uh -huh. What is the future that Destiny's slave sees behind this course of action? Are we the ones? <laughs> kind of weird. Would we help them escape? Is that why they wanted us here so bad? But why would we do that? I mean, willingly at least. Are we a big enough factor to where we can cause it to change? Hmm, I don't know, I don't know. Wilt is deep in thought. Dude, I like Wilt. What the heck, man? He's so intelligent. I appreciate it. <laughs> my dad is an ace pilot. You continue oh, your, your thought Sorry, process, my guy. <laughs> the nature of which is confidential and cannot be disclosed. Oh, is that a Sienjo motto or something? <laughs> First the Skyfaring Commission, now the Divination Commission. They're all so secretive. Oh, the General's the only friendly face here. March, I just want to say, I think you're a little biased. 
In the sense that the general is a handsome looking man, and all the other people we've talked to are women. <laughs> I'm just messing. I'm just messing. <laughs> but am I wrong though? Am I wrong? <laughs> I do. I'm also uh, doubtful of all of them, but March is so funny. Oh my gosh, I love her. <laughs> I hate to admit it, but I'm even starting to miss Sampo. Hold up. Girl, I must be losing my mind. <laughs> you are. Nope. I'll take this Yenjo over that blue-haired boar any day. <laughs> I cannot believe you just said that. See, did that just prove my point or what? Sampo is a man. <laughs> I'm totally kidding. I'm totally kidding. <laughs> oh, we've gone from being chased through every street in Balabog to waiting on every corner in this Yenjo. <laughs> Chasing and waiting. Maybe that's what life's all about. No. Wow, when did you become a poet? <laughs> hmm. I'm not just a pretty face, you know. Mm -hmm. I've got poetry on standby 24-7. Cool, I wish you would say it more often then. <laughs> Does the Shinjo scenery seem familiar to you? <gasps> oh yeah, because I guess where she's from. She She's not from here, is she? Are you wondering if the <laughs> Sienjo is my homeworld? Yeah. I don't think it is, but it could be. You never know. No, I'm not getting any flashbacks. Okay. <laughs> Please, do I look sienjo ish to you? No. <laughs> you must be thinking of Don Hung. I mean, he did straight up admit, like, he's been here, so... Yeah, I miss Don Hung. Come on, let's go take a stroll and clear your head. Ah, <sighs> good idea. Let's go. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Clear my head of what? Of thinking of all the men. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Please don't be mad at me. <laughs> That's the plaza. Uh, so good. But uh, I can't see anyone waiting for us. Mm. Should we look around? I mean, um, it does look like some people um, have fallen over over there. You and by the way, I'm one to talk. On Literally, I have all the men on my team, okay? <laughs> um... Hmm, I'm a little concerned to uh, go over there. What's oh, going on with him? Oh. Ah, ah, oh. Ah, oh crap, oh crap. He's a bad guy now. Everybody stay back! Who the what? <laughs> Who the heck is that? <laughs> Give him this medicine and uh, make him lie down! Uh, uh, oh, it's like a little uh, dragon baby. <laughs> I mean, make them lie down! <laughs> she actually looks really Hiding cute. Is meaningless. Well, the heck is like a little dragon baby. <laughs> so cute. Nice. Uh, that'll teach you a lesson. She's so Ready cute. To lie down now. <laughs> What a cute little thing. <laughs> Thanks for helping to stabilize the patients. Your assertive sedation techniques are quite effective. <laughs> assertive sedation techniques? Mm. Uh, does she mean beating people up? Indeed. However, these cloud knights were already sick. And now okay. they're injured too. Yeah, sorry I about that. I could bandage up their wounds, realign their bones. Ugh, as if I didn't have enough on my plate. <laughs> sorry. Aren't you a little young to be realigning bones? I'm going to need to see some qualifications. Aren't you a little young to be a doctor? Where did you come from, little one? Is your dad around? I don't have a dad. Do you have a mom? Uh, what about... About your mom. I don't have a mom either. Oh, wee baby. <sighs> I get it. You think because I'm small, I must be a runaway child. I didn't think that. <laughs> Welcome to the Xian Show, my short lived outsider friends. Appearances can be deceiving here. The Vidyadara race is self reincarnating. No mom or dad required. Oh. What? That's cool. 
I've been studying the art of oh. healing ever since I cast off my old shell. You're looking at a recognized, practicing, dedicated doctor. Okay, well then how old are you really then? Bellabog kids are making snowmen, while children here are writing prescriptions. Things haven't been very peaceful in the lawful recently. Make sure you don't... <laughs> go running around, right? Well, your general gave us an errand, so I'm afraid we have to. Hmm. Well, seeing as you saved me just now, if you're unlucky enough to acquire any breaks or sprains, I'll treat you for free. Mm -hmm. As for medicine, I'll give you a 20% discount. <laughs> Thank you. That doesn't sound very free. So you're still charging us. <laughs> That's sweet. Ha! Do you have any idea how many people in the law floor are waiting for an appointment with me? No. You should count this as a blessing. If I hadn't left my purse at home, I wouldn't have to... What? <laughs> Enough of that. I have patience to see. Okay. Good luck. Our little miracle worker seems very different from everyone else around. Don't you think, Mr. Yang? So this is the Vidyadara. I've only ever read about them. She's so cute. They're known She's as a widow. the dragon race. Not hard to see why. She's so widow, so cute. <laughs> um Oh, okay. Gotta look for the messenger. Everyone, please remain calm. This is an announcement from the Realm Keeping Commission General Bureau. Exalting Sanctum is temporarily closing its borders and navigation routes. The details will be outlined in the official bulletin sent to your Jade Abacus soon. If you feel unwell, please report to the Realm Keeping Commission as soon as possible. We have doctors from the Alchemy Commission here who will see you free of charge. Oh, uh, we will be distributing a bag of protein rice and emergency medicine to each of you. You can collect the supplies from me in person, or the commission can deliver them to your door. <laughs> Hello, I'm here to collect supplies. Hello, how's the Divination Commission faring? Can Please I? Please register with your Jade Abacus bracelet. Mm. Oh, you must be an outsider. I see. Please sign here. Oh. I heard there's a problem with their Meridian pin. Some diviners and stargazers managed to escape the delve. Many of them were terrified. They were muttering about plants and roots. Mm. Something terrible must have happened there. Do you have friends trapped in the delve? No. If you're worried about them, find a diviner and see if they can tell you what happened. Thanks. Thanks for everything you're doing. I want to say it's all in a day's work, but I've been here for 12 hours already. Ooh. When will this end? Oh, thank you then. Sheesh, no thank you. Um, hmm. Oh. I totally didn't notice it. It rains, you. it pours. The Artisanship Commission has its own issues. It sounds serious, too. Go and inform the Cloud Knights. See if you can... I think I found him. Oh, my Finally. Apologies. I'm an orderly from the Realm Keeping Commission. Judging by your dress, you must be visitors to the Law Fu. Mm-hmm. Yes, I'm a guest. The general invited me. <laughs> and I'm a civil servant. The general hired me. I was just letting you know, okay, you butthole. <laughs> Technically speaking, every traveler aboard the Law Fu is a guest of the general. Oh, really? If the port oh. is still open, well, I, wasn't I before, would suggest okay. you take a boat to Starskiff Haven right away. Though, I heard the route may have been uh, temporarily suspended. Oh, that reminds me. I have a friend with a star skiff and a travel permit. He could help you and your friends get over quickly. <sighs> the price is fair and negotiable. What do you think? No need. I have a vessel picking me up. Well, now, you must be quite special. No, I'm hey, not. Don't spread this around. I'm not hired. But uh, this isn't some small-scale maintenance drill. The general has sent the Cloud Knights to check for hidden dangers. Yeah, cool beans. You may not need it right now, but if there's any help I can give you, come to me anytime. No, thank you. You would you bagged on me at the very start. Bad first impression, my friend. <laughs> Excuse me, miss. Hold on a moment. It was only thanks to your help earlier that the dragon lady and those exalting sanctum residents got away unscathed. Dragon Lady? Our help. 
The Dragon Lady of the Alchemy Commission. Mm -hmm. Lady Bailu. You mean the child? She's starting to sound like a big shot. A friend in the Skyfaring Commission told me the General Commission guests to deal with the troubles on the Lafu. Mm -hmm. You must be the guests. Indeed. If you don't mind, I hope you can take the time to come to the Realm Keeping Commission. I'd like to talk to you about the issues Exalting Sanctum is currently facing. Okay, I guess. Oh! <gasps> Don Hung! Something happened just now. I just arrived at the Shinjo. Are you alright? Finally! What happened? What are you doing on the Shinjo? Yes, but what happened? Express okay, what are you doing? Okay, good. I asked all of it. <laughs> I'll pretend that you replied, I'm okay. <laughs> it's a long story. I'm at Cloudford with a cloud night. I'll join you when I come out. By the way, the express is fine. I came here by myself. I'll tell you about it later. Okay. I'm very interested. <laughs> tell me the details. What? Oh. What? It's just a challenge. Should I do it right now? Why not? If the shipping passages in Cloudford changed Good. even a little, the entire route would be drastically altered. Do you two know the way? I do not. <laughs> I came this way. I know it like the back of my hand. Just follow me. Um, so, silent but deadly, let me know when you're ready and we can set off. <laughs> Is that a nickname she gave him? Silent but deadly? Do you hail from the Law Fu, young master Don Hung? Mm. I do. No, <laughs> remain silent. I mean, I don't... Does he? I don't know. Apologies. Forgive my curiosity. I'm also curious as to the answer. I just don't know it, so I don't want to... I don't know. I do often struggle to judge the boundaries of small talk. <laughs> I hope I haven't offended you. No. I'd like to ask you something. Hmm. Please do. How much do you know about the LaFu being sealed off? Almost nothing. I was scheduled to leave the LaFu when I heard there was a disturbance. Miss Sushang here is a member of the Cloud Knights. You could try asking her. Who is this Cloud Knight girl? Her name is Sushang. She apparently just transferred here from the Yao Qing. Every Senjo ship operates individually, but the Cloud Knights are all commanded by the Marshal. Therefore, it's normal for knights to transfer between ships. Okay. Let's talk about you. Me? Mm-hmm. You don't seem like you're from the Shinjo. Where have you come from? Huh. Merchants don't belong anywhere. We wander and make the stars our home. But if you're curious, Within the Alliance, I'm registered at the Xianjiu Yutre. Within the IPC, I'm registered at the Star Unity Mall branch at the North Valley Star. I don't know what any of that means. <laughs> Therefore, Luo Cha is just the name I use within the Xianjiu. Okay. Outside of the Xianjiu, I use something more difficult to pronounce. Oh. I'm guessing you want to know that name too? Sure, can you say it? Hey, say it! <laughs> You have pretty good fighting skills for a merchant. The universe is a dangerous place. The IPC and the Alliance only provide for our safety during interstellar travel. On-site security is dependent on our own capacities. Hmm. As such, I had to improve my swordplay and healing skills. You are also a wanderer, young master Don Hung. Surely you understand. Hmm. What's in that coffin? Is that a coffin? Ah, a story of ill luck. I found myself embroiled in a conflict and ended up owing a favor. Now I must assist in delivering these remains back to the Xianjo. Oh, okay. So that's probably why he's here then? It would seem I am a magnet for such misfortune. I thought I would be safe on the La Fu. But now... Yeah. Of course. Right. Excuse me. Thank you for the chit chat. Let's go for a little bit longer. Silent but deadly. 
Are you sure that nickname isn't annoying you? I like it. Not at all. I don't mind. <laughs> Remain silent. Should I? <laughs> to keep it up? <laughs> I should learn to be this easygoing. <laughs> Let's go. I'd like to ask you something. Mm -hmm. Uh, go ahead. I'll tell you everything I know. How much do you know about the Lafu being sealed off? I heard Same they questions. found an antimatter legion bomb. Mm. Out of safety, they locked down the entire ship. They'll only reopen it after they've removed the bomb. I don't know if all that's true, though. Could have been the Stellaron that exploded then? Anyway, the higher-ups mm. didn't say anything. They just got me to evacuate the civilians at Cloudford. Have you met this low Cha before? Nope, I met him when I met you. But yeah, now that you mention it, maybe I did see him somewhere. Oh? He seems a bit familiar. Where would that have been? Huh. Let's talk about you. Me? Uh, there's not much to talk about. When did you join the Cloud Knights? Not that long ago. But I've been receiving strict Cloud Knight military training since I was a child. My parents are both famous on the Yaojin. I wouldn't be here otherwise. They've been training me ever since I was born. Don't look down on me just because I'm a new recruit. No. I wouldn't dare. You're from the Yaojin? What'd she say? Yep. Have you been there before? Nope. I feel the Yao Qing and the La Fu have different characteristics. I might be a La Fu Cloud Knight now, but I still think the Yao Qing is better. For example, when it comes to leadership, I don't think General Qing Yuan is as reliable as our Madam General back on the Yao Qing. Ooh, some words being thrown, but fascinating. Uh, Good to know. Actually, forget about the last sentence. Just <laughs> pretend I never said it. Too late. Okay, but think fast. So. Wrong well, one, sorry. Can we move out? Let's go. I'll lead the way. You two keep an eye on our surroundings. Not exactly my expertise. I'm just a traveling merchant. Can I this knock? is life and death, okay? You look like you can handle yourself. How come you're so lazy? <laughs> Bold of you to assume my appearance betray. Oh. Sorry. I thought it was like a door thing, not this one. No, dang it. My bad. Okay, okay, I have to stick to the script. I'm hey, sorry. Silent but deadly. Yes. Shout if you see any danger, okay? Ah! Don't think just because you know a move. Danger! <laughs> Too late to repent. Is that what you wanted to hear? <laughs> Zero points. <sighs> Past victories don't guarantee future ones. What is this on the floor? Backstab. <laughs> Not nice. reach the end of the story in your own way. March is six-faced ice. Oh, that's March. No wonder it looked familiar. There was a fight here. Mm-hmm. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. So, I've been here before? Gosh, this place just looks... It's all the same. <laughs> I don't know if I've been here or not. A cloud knight stricken with Mara. How could the mutations get this bad? Is the Stellaron exerting an effect? Yes. There's supposed to be a passage. Why can't I see it? Somebody used the Cloud Ford control panel to block the road with containers. Uh, who did this? I'm terrible with machines and stuff. Hold on. How do you know? That's what it looks like. I'm a traveling merchant. I've been here many times. <laughs> now, for a cloud knight to be unfamiliar with the local topography. I told you, I was only just transferred here from the Yao Qing. I don't come here very often.
control panel. Where is... Is that the one? Let me see. Whoa, Locha, you've got sharp eyes! I'm like way ahead of you guys. <laughs> <laughs> I almost messed that up. We caught them unawares. Seize the initiative. Something's not right, boy. Nicely done. There's one star skip left. What? Where? Where does it go? Judging by where it's docked, it must be heading for Central Star Skip Haven. Nice. We'll be safe there. Hmm. <laughs> Come on, let's climb aboard. Let's hurry and get on the star skip. Okay. Nice. Got to play his little side story. It's getting late. Where to now? Uh. Okay, a little bit more. Let's see. Oh. Greetings, Master Diviner. Oh, greetings. Master Diviner asked me to wait for you. It's about time. Can't go. I'm busy right now. Is that where we're supposed to go? What does that mean? <laughs> it's just a picture. Are we supposed to meet someone there? I think so. It's like one of those messages a kidnapper sends in a horror movie. <laughs> That's enough of that. Come on, let's go. Uh, it's all right, we got Wilt with us. Dad's got her back. Hurry up, Chingcha. We'll be fossils by the time you're finished. I heard there was a disaster in the Divination Commission's delve. I'm surprised you're in the mood to play right now, Chingchua. His VA sounds familiar. Even if the sky was going to collapse on the Divination Commission, the Master Diviner would be there to hold it up. What she lacks in height, she more than makes up for in stamina. Huh? Anyway, I didn't come here just to play. She ordered me to wait here for our guests. Oh. Time is precious. I'm simply multitasking. I see. It's the place in the photo, all right. Is this a games parlor? Uh, what kind of problem can they possibly be facing? I don't know. <laughs> Isn't this hand a problem? I have the worst luck. Oh, uh, hi there. I can tell just by looking at you that you're the Divination Commission's guests. Did you bring us here just for this? Do you even know how long we've been waiting? You don't want the Master Diviner to know you've been slacking off, do you? Hmm, how? First impression. Hmm. I know, I know, I'm sorry. I was going to wait for you by the statue, but... Ah! Triplet! But folks from the Realm Keeping Commission descended on the area. It's too loud over there now. Pass! Pass! <sighs> so I thought to myself, wouldn't it be better to meet somewhere quieter? Four of a kind! Okay. And wouldn't that be more fun, too? 
better to show you the Don't real me, exalting sanctum and introduce you to a true CM Joe pastime, Celestial Jade. Now that my wish has been fulfilled, there's nothing holding us back. Follow me, honored guests. All right. I must apologize for your long wait, honored guests. It wasn't too long. Seeing your enthusiasm for this Celestial Jade game has stoked my curiosity. Not mine. <laughs> I'm glad to hear it. You clearly have excellent taste. If you're interested, I can show you how to play. It's great fun. Sure. Mr. Yang! Don't fall into it. Oh. Oh. Oopsie poopsie. I didn't know. Sorry. You've smashed countless innocent vases like this before, but this one is remarkably... Is mark... Markedly? Is markedly different. What? Instead of shattering to pieces as expected, it somehow stays in place most motionless. Hey, what are you doing? A sudden strange cry emanates from the vase. You've been You've been a nameless for a while now and consider yourself experienced in many things, but this is still a shock. Oh my gosh. A talking vase? Whack it again. Have you ever seen a talking vase before? Sober up. I'm the immortal in a vase, and I've lived in this vase in seclusion for thousands of years. And if it weren't for a klutz like you today, I'd probably have chilled out another few millennia more. Oh, whack it again. Sorry. No matter, no matter. Living in a snail shell is pleasant enough, but I still perceive boredom once in a long while. Your disturbance is not unwelcomed, it seems. This vase may be an ordinary object, but with the blessings of my power, a pipsqueak like you won't be able to, sh to shake it up at all. Why do you live inside of a vase? How did you get in there? Why don't you live in a vase? <laughs> The mortal world is cruel and evil, evil, and only within this vase can I enjoy my peace. The universe is an infinite birdcage, and this snail shell is as liberating as an entire world. Okay. In fact, with the amount of power I have, most people wouldn't notice this vase. Yet you did. If you're not an extraordinary person already, then you're destined for greatness somewhere. Why don't you give me a hand? Consider this an apology for disturbing me. Sounds like a hassle. No thanks. All right. Sounds interesting. Is there any advantage to helping you out? <laughs> Very well. How considerate, how considerate. Well then, please help me out. It's nothing difficult and there's no rush. Just do it when you have the time. Please find me five bags of trash? Within this vase lies a spotless vacuum. What? And I've always felt it lacks the hustle and bustle of normal life. Once you find the trash, simply toss them into my vase. Don't I actually have some trash on me? Put the items inside? Yeah, I have trash. You gaze down at the trash in your hands, then back at this relatively small vase. Can you really stuff this much trash into the vase into this vase? But it's not something for you to ponder over. After all, pedestrians in the Exalted Sanctum also can't imagine you running all over the place with bags of trash. <laughs> you stuff one bag into, this, into the vase. It should drop down to the bottom, but you don't hear any sound. Then you shove in the remaining trash. They disappear without a sound. This is the hustle and bustle of the mortal realm. I didn't expect you actually to bring it. <laughs> hmm, very well. That's exactly what I wanted. Here's a gift for you. The gates to the celestial realm are open. Come and get it. Put your hand in. You won't bite me, right? You dip your left hand in as a precaution, smart, keeping your dominant hand free to use a weapon, a toothbrush, or a fork in the future. You touch the bottom of the vase. The rubbish you dropped in is nowhere to be found, and there's nothing that might be the immortal. Oh, and there's nothing that might be the immortal in the vase. Then you do feel something. It's the immortal's gift. You pull out your hand. The vase stands before you in silence. Really? That's it? Ah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Ah, oh, look. Is that 
Uh, what is it? It's an ancient tree. We call it the Ambrosial Arbor. Huh. It was once the Sienjo La Fu's prized treasure. But not anymore? I didn't know the Skyfaring Commission were history buffs. Not that. <laughs> Younger generations usually don't know much about it. It's said that the Ambrosial Arbor is an ancient remnant from where the Sienjo roamed the ether. From a distance, it looks like half a tree stump. But according to records of the early nation, in its prime, it wound into the heavens and from it celestial bodies hung. Wow. Meaning? Huh. It means the tree was as tall as the sky and stars hung from its branches. Thank you, Wilt. So, how big was it? Bigger than the Express? Bigger than Herta Space Station? No, that can't be right. Stars hung from its branches. Then, how did it fit in the Sienjo? Technically, any tree in the spaceship fits this description. <laughs> True. It sounds like an unimaginable, unimaginably magnificent tree. Exactly. Let's just say it was bigger than your imagination. Hmm, my imagination is pretty good, so I don't know. <laughs> anyway, it's just a legend. I see this view every day on my way to work. I'm kind of bored of it. Oh, that's sad. Let's go. Yeah, it doesn't look very big anymore. Oh. Maybe it is further down. Huh. You'd be a tool to miss a tile. Need your extractor clean to your star skiff service? <laughs> We're almost there, everyone. Stay close. Just a heads up, please don't go running off once we're inside. Why not? You may be the Master Diviner's guests, but she hates people who don't abide by rules and regulations. Oh, and people who ask too many questions, not to mention... Please, don't push your buttons. <laughs> We're just for here March. for the questioning. We'll leave as soon as it's over. Mm-hmm. There we are. Um, I do want to leave it here for the day. Let's kill these guys and then we'll do that. Is that another puzzle? <gasps> oh, finish the puzzles! Alrighty, well, I'm going to leave that here for this, this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. We're making a little bit of progress, uh, finding out a little bit more of the story, which is interesting. And if I'm not mistaken, they said something about Kafka's interrogation is up next. So I'm excited for that, a little nervous about it, but I think it should be really, really good. <laughs> anyway, if you guys enjoyed the video, don't forget to like the video, subscribe to my channel if you wanna see more Star Rail content. And, uh, yeah, feel free to leave your thoughts in the comments below. But I hope you beautiful bright stars have a superb rest of your day. <laughs> and I will see you in the next video. All right. Later. <laughs>